Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Christina DeWittewitz and today's video is gonna be all about Teamy. Now you may have heard about Teamy from a lot of celebrities like Bristol Palin. I think Cardi B was another one that talks about Teamy on their Instagram post. So I'm actually a Teamy partner and I do get to try a lot of their items, but there are some that just aren't my favorite. So today I thought I'd talk about some of my favorite Teamy products. And this way you know that I'm being transparent with all of you. I do try all of the products that they send me, but I only genuinely talk about the ones that I really, really like. Now, of course, if they send us a new product that's coming out, they want us to post about it, promote it, you know, get the word out there about it. So I definitely do do that because that is something that's required with this Teamy partnership. But if I find myself using some of their products over and over again, that means you're gonna see me talk about it even more. So of course, Teamy's known for their Teamy blends. And that was one of the first things I tried when I partnered up with the brand. And so you've probably seen their tumblers, which I think are so cute. And also because they're insulated well so if you want a hot drink or a cold drink you're not gonna burn or freeze your hands and then of course there's a little snack pack on the bottom I really like these colors I think this is periwinkle and I think this might be called mint I'm not too sure but I'll try to find these colors if they still have it in stock and link them down below this is really great for their tea blends because this this has a little strainer inside. So all of their tumblers come at least these kinds of blenders, not the smoothie kinds, which I haven't tried yet. Um, or all, they all have that feature. So I do like their tumblers. I think they're pretty cute. But the thing is, I'm not a big tea drinker to begin with. One of their teas that I tried was the skinny tea and I still have some left and I do reach for it every now and then, but not as much as the products I'm reaching out for that I'm going to talk about with you today. So their skinny tea blend is good. I think it tastes very similar to the Starbucks green tea, um, like an ice green tea. I just normally drink tons of water naturally. Like I don't drink soda. I drink juice, but not all the time. I'm a big fan of V8 juice, the mango and peach flavor, the energy drink kind of. Um, but other than that, I just normally drink water. And then of course the occasional alcohol. So that's why you don't see me talk about their tea blends a lot. I think they're good. It's just not something I drink every day. Now, one of their product lines I'm a huge fan of is their skincare line. One of their products I've been using every single day and night since I got it. And that is their facial oils. So they have three facial oils, but I've only been using two. I've been using the Repair and Glow facial oils and they're all tea infused. I think they smell great and they look pretty cute, I think. But the best part about them is that they actually work. So I was actually really, really hesitant when I first started using facial oils. I actually never really looked into them because I have oily skin. And if you've seen my video where I talk about this initially, I mentioned that, that I was super hesitant about it because of my oily skin. And I thought it was gonna make my skin even more oily or just greasier in general. And I did not want that. But after reading more about the product online and actually learning about facial oils, because I did have to educate myself on that, I learned that this can actually help balance the oil levels in your skin. What I mean by when I say they work is that these work to brighten up my dark spots. So I'm wearing a lot of makeup right now, so you probably can't see my sunspots clearly, but I have a few patches around my nose, uh, definitely a few around here, but the ones that I noticed to really start fading first were the ones above my lip. Now, if I were to take up my makeup, you would of course see them, but before I started using these facial oils, they were pretty, pretty dark. And I was like, why is this happening? And you know, it could be a number of things. It could be from your birth control. It could be from just your sun exposure. Um, so it really could just be a bunch of reasons. But these have ingredients that they say can help improve those dark spots. So I use the Glow Facial Oil in the morning before I put on some makeup, and then I use the Repair Oil at night. And then you can see in the glow oil that this has rose petals in there. It's supposed to help with hydration and kind of refresh the skin. And what I like about both of these is that they do not clog your pores up. And you can easily see in the repair oil that there are chamomile tea flowers. So they're not only just cute to look at, you get to see actual improvement in your skin. And that's why I've kept up with using both of these just because I can see that change in my skin and Look how much I've used. And I only use about three to four drops for each oil um, each time. And you can get these individually or you can get them in a set. And one of the options is to get this 
with this and a vitamin C serum, which I haven't tried, but I definitely want to. Also, if you've been following me for a while and on Instagram, you know that I was also a skeptic about these facial rollers. I, I always thought of these as a temporary fix. Like it's nothing long-term. You're not gonna see any long-term effects. So this can help push these products deeper into your skin. And it's also a nice facial massage, but temporary or not, I use this more than I thought I would. Why? Well, because it helps with my sinus headaches. So I'll use either end and I'll just roll it right over here and it helps a ton. If I don't wear my blue screen glasses, I'll get a sinus headache. I get sinus headaches from being in front of a screen for too long, like a computer, my phone, the TV, and sometimes just randomly, I don't even know. So this helps a ton in addition to blue screen glasses. But if it's so, so bad and my blue screen glasses aren't making the whole headache go away, then I will use this as well and it it's just amazing and it feels good. This also can help wake you up in the morning if you keep this in your fridge. Um, I personally don't use it a ton for rolling my face, but I love it for this. It's amazing. So if you have sinus headaches right here between your eyes on the bridge of your nose, I would definitely recommend using this if you have one already or get one because it's amazing. But when I was using this regularly to try it out and test it, I did notice it made my skin look smoother. I was also using these at the same time. So basically I would use this, put it on my face and then roll it in and it did it definitely look smoother. But am I using this every day? No, I'm using it every now and then, basically when I have a major headache, a sinus headache. The next thing I wanna talk about is my favorite face mask, my beauty face mask of all time. And it is Teamy's Beauty Mask Restorative Clay Facial. So this is made with zinc oxide, kaolin clay, probably mispronounced that, and butterfly pea, which I had never heard of before this product. This smells so amazing to me. It's just something I always have to mention every time I talk about this in a video because I just love it. My favorite thing about this mask is that you can use this multiple times and it's not gonna irritate your skin. It's that gentle. I usually use this at night, but sometimes I will use it in the morning, but I just like after a nice hot shower and your pores are open, I just love using this mask. Right after using this mask, I feel like my skin is refreshed. It's softer, smoother. It's just a good time for my face. One thing I was surprised to find out though is that this color is completely natural. So if you don't already know, Timmy makes all of their products with natural ingredients. A lot of their items are plant-based. They make plant-based solutions plant-based solutions with their products. And it's a clay mask, so you can feel it harden a little bit. So after about, I think it says 10 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes, I do the full 15 minutes, sometimes a little more, just because I kind of like how that feeling after I wash off the face mask. You can notice the mask tightening up and then you really can't move your face a lot. It's kind of funny. And then also you kind of look like a Smurf, but the end result is so good for you. So if you've been looking for a mask and you have yet to try this one, I definitely, definitely recommend it. If there's one thing I think you should try out, I think start off with the mask. I was never a huge beauty face mask person to begin with, and this has totally changed that for me. Now I've used sheet masks uh, before, uh, like from Target, but that was like really once every few months, but this has made my mask routine like, multiple times a week now. The next thing I wanna talk about is kinda of like a green smoothie for your face. And it is their superfood cleanser. And you can see I am almost out. Now it is a small bottle and I don't even use a full pump to wash my face. I use actually kind of like a half pump because I'm trying to save as much as I can. And what I do is the double cleansing method where I use a cleansing balm to take off my makeup first. And then I go in a second time with one of my cleansers. And this is what I've been using lately. So this is something I keep right next to my bathroom sink. And I keep a different cleanser in my bathroom or in the bath, in the shower. That way I'm not having to constantly carry them back and forth. I don't know why it's just like moving from here to here with my arm, but for some reason I just, I just don't want to do that. So as I mentioned, I keep this by my sink. So this is what I use at night when I am doing my nighttime skincare routine. You could easily use this for both day and night or just day or just night. But for me, I like to use this to basically cleanse my skin of everything from 
the whole day. If you don't know about the double cleansing method, I will link a video to my process and what I do here in the little card. And I will also link to it down below in case you want to watch it later. But this has always left my skin feeling so fresh and clean. I also want to say crisp just because it's such a fresh scent. But well, that's probably not the right word, but this definitely does remind me of a green juice, a green smoothie. It's just so fresh. And if it's out of place, like if my fiance moves my uh, cleanser somewhere, like on the other side of the sink, I'm just like, where is my cleanser? This is ruining my skincare routine. Another product I tried and really ended up liking, but didn't repurchase yet is their toner, their butterfly mist toner. It comes in a little glass, um, spray bottle and it's like nice purple color and that was something i bought myself i didn't wait for them to send me that i just really wanted to try it and so i did and i like that it was a toner that you can spray onto a cotton round and use it that way or they say you can use it as a little facial mist to freshen your face throughout the day and i really liked that a lot i think it smelled great i think it worked well i also like that it was a natural toner because i don't use all natural products all the time i use a lash serum and i'm sure that's not natural and so i do use a mix of both natural um organic items and items full of chemicals so i'm not showing you these products to push you to go ahead and go that natural skincare route really use what works for you and for me it's a mix of items so if you're looking for a natural plant-based toner i would definitely give teamy's toner a try so right now if you're feeling a little bit lost not sure where to start well you can look into some bundles and i never actually looked into their bundles until the, around the christmas season and they have some pretty good options now now you can try items individually, of course, but if you want to try a mix of products, I would definitely go for the bundles. And I say that because you can get a mix of items. You can get skincare bundles, tea bundles. So if you want to break it up that way, you can. So for one of them, I see it on my computer right now. You can get the glow oil, this facial roller, and a vitamin C serum. It's called the Skin Love Kit. And there's also a bundle where you can try all three of their facial oils, but I think two is more than enough. If you wanna go the tea route, they have bundles that include one of their tumblers. So that's something you could try out. One of the bundles also comes with a little brush. I think it's a silicone brush cleaner uh, so that you can clean your tumbler. And because I am a teamy partner, I have a discount code for you to use on any of these products. I'm gonna leave that information down below in the description box, along with a direct link to each of these products so that you can go and check them out yourself. And if you have tried any of Timmy's products, let me know what's been your favorite. And maybe there's some that you've tried that I haven't. And please let me know which ones those are because I'm always down to try out new products. And you guys give me the best recommendations, especially with my Rothy's handbags and shoes. That's been genuinely helpful for me. And because of you guys, I ventured out and tried out a different style of shoe. So definitely want to experience the same thing with my skincare from Timmy. So let me know what you love and what you think I should try out too. All right, guys, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Give it a like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.